what's going on guys living Gonzalez here back with another pokemon go video and today you guys may have seen a new time research hit your pokemon go account and you may be wondering where the heck did this come from well do remember a few weeks ago i did make a video that yes a new timed research that does give ultra beast encounters would hit some trainers accounts and this is because of this tweet right here niantic did tweet this out on july 22nd trainers we appreciate the feedback from social channels and in-game support regarding the issue with special backgrounds not being obtained from remote raids on day one of the global go fest so they did an investigation with this issue and tried to come up with a solution to make up for this glitch that did impact a lot of trainers and this is what they said impacted trainers will receive timed research that awards encounters with ultra beasts and necrozma with guaranteed special backgrounds at a future date the research granted will award a number of encounters equal to the special backgrounds they could have received during the event and will last until december 31st 2025 so yeah if you guys did remote raids for ultra beast pokemon or necrozma on day one of the go fest you might have some encounters with those ultra beast pokemon slash necrozma in your timed research now you might be wondering well i did like 50 raids of necrozma on day one of the go fest why do i not have 50 encounters of necrozma in the time research that looks like this well if you guys read the tweet again it's gonna award you a number of encounters equal to the special backgrounds they could have received during the event so therefore they're only going to give you a certain amount of encounters based off a ratio of the amount of raids raids you did which i believe the chance of getting a background from a raid is about a 1 in 20 chance so for the total number of encounters they're going to give you in that time research they're probably going to give you guys about maybe 5 to 10 percent of the total number of remote raids that you guys did during day one of the go fest because again yeah the background i think has a chance of like 1 in 10 to 1 in 20 chance i don't know what the exact odds are but somewhere in there so yeah you're only gonna get a fraction of encounters compared to the number of raids you did on day one so yeah with this research the tasks are already auto completed all you guys have to do is just simply claim your reward until it does expire which that is like 492 days away so you have plenty of time to catch these ultra beast pokemon and yes they can be shiny they should still be 1 in 20 shiny rate in this time research i've seen plenty of people get shiny zirkatree shiny necrozma shiny kartana from this new makeup time research so i know for a fact the shinies are a enabled and again every catch you do on these ultra beast pokemon and the Krosma do have a guaranteed background the ultra wormhole background is guaranteed to be on these ultra beast pokemon and the Krosma. so again if you did like three remote raids of guzzlord two celesteela and one remote raid of kartana on day one of the global go fest you probably have no time research encounters because again it is based off a certain ratio because it is about a one in 20 chance to get a special background on these raid bosses so yeah guys make sure you check your account right now you might have a lot of encounters with these pokemon if you guys did do a lot of remote raids on day one of the go fest and i believe also with these ultra beast pokemon you are catching all of them with a beast ball i don't think you can use any berries however so you cannot pineapp these pokemon but you are catching them with beast balls and also i think you're catching them at the level 20 cp value so if you guys need the hundo iv cp values of all the ultra beast pokemon Pokemon, they are right here. So yeah, Guzzlord 1650, for example, Celesteela 1772, 1882, Stakataka, all of those are listed right here. And if you guys need the Hundo IV CP value for Necrozma, it is 2104. 
so yeah guys let me know in the comments below did you get any encounters with any ultra beast pokemon or necrozma let me know in the comments below and let me know how many encounters pokemon go did give you did they give you eight encounters 10 20 encounters let me know thank you guys so much for watching today's video if you guys enjoyed make sure to drop a like on the video subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next one peace